What is going on everybody? I am back today to talk about a film that was nominated for Best International Film at the Academy Awards and I saw the trailer for this movie multiple times last year and I thought it looked fascinating and it was one of the movies nominated for an Academy Award this year that I really wanted to get a chance to watch before the Academy Awards but unfortunately that did not happen. I didn't get the opportunity to check it out in time but I finally watched it and I'm really looking forward to talking about it with you today and the film I'm going to be discussing is The Teacher's Lounge. The Teacher's Lounge is directed by Ilkar Katag. When one of her students is suspected of theft, teacher Carla Nowak decides to get to the bottom of the matter. Caught between her ideals in the school system, the consequences of her actions threaten to break her. So, as I said, I was very excited to watch this movie because I thought the premise looked very interesting and the way that the trailer was cut together really had me immersed and excited to watch it. And I thought this was really good. I don't think that it's perfect. I think that it for its subject matter and its premise, they definitely could have restructured specific scenes to make it a little bit more impactful. But I do think overall, it's a really entertaining film with an incredible lead performance that is 100% worth your time checking out. And I'm excited to dive into it a little bit with you today. So at the beginning of the movie, we are introduced to Carla, played by Leonie Banesh. And she works at this school. She has just, re as we learn through dialogue, she has recently transferred there. She's only been working there for three or four months I believe but we can see really early on her students really like her and she's incredibly passionate about her job and she works really hard to take care of the students and she takes a lot of pride in her job and we hear conversations in the break room early on about a series of thefts that is going on in the school and we see a young kid get pulled out of the classroom early on and his parents get called in and the film takes place in Germany and this young kid clearly is not German and his parents come in and he feels you can tell the parents and him feel as though he has been racially profiled for this theft and his parents explain they have money and they give their child money and want to make sure they have enough money for lunch and to just do the things that they want to do and so early on we can see Carla see that situation and she feels incredibly uncomfortable with it and the way that the teachers have approached the situation and so after we hear more conversations surrounding these thefts and she decides to set her laptop up in the break room and turn the video recording on to see if a student is stealing and she leaves her money in the pocket of her coat while well, she catches on camera someone with a very specific blouse on pulling money out of her coat pocket and so shortly after that she takes it to the principal and they accuse a teacher of being the one stealing and the teacher ends up being asked to leave and the entire film is that teacher student goes to the school and the entire film is Carla second guessing whether or not she did the right thing by taking this to the school district did she even get the right person and that person's reaction to that and how they try to fight against it and the film turns into this suspenseful edge of your seat ride that I did not expect. So as I said, I thought this movie was really good. And for starters, I want to talk about Leone Banesh's incredible performance. I feel like being a teacher has got to be one of the most difficult positions to be in, especially in this day and age with children's access to technology and, you know, the way things can be recorded. You have to watch how you speak to kids. You have to be very delicate. And also, if you're passionate about children's learning, you want to make sure that they're engaged and you want to make sure they're doing their work and, and learning about the things that you're putting in front of them so that they can, you know, be intelligent, thoughtful people. And watching her character try to do the best that she can in every situation, but even in doing the best thing possible, it ends up blowing back on her in a really negative way. And we see it through her facial expressions and her reactions to situations and just the inflection in her dialogue. And I thought that she was just remarkable. She was was the one who kept me hooked to the screen through the entire runtime of the film. I just never wanted to look away because of her powerhouse performance. The cinematography in this was really nice. I think the way it was edited together for a film that virtually all takes place inside of a school, I felt like the way it was cut and the way scenes transitioned kept you on the edge of your seat. And also the use of sound in this movie. The music and the sound design is unnerving. You are you are constantly wondering 
what's going to happen scene after scene after scene. And you're constantly second guessing, did this person do this or did they not do this? And there's a couple of moments where this, these weird surrealist type of things happen that are out of the realm of normal that I was really impressed that the filmmaker incorporated into the movie where you're kind of like, okay, this is symbolically representative of the situation that is going on. And I love for a movie that is very straightforward that the director was able to take the time to do some things that are out of the realm of normal to convey the overall message. And I love when filmmakers are willing to take risks like that. And as I said, I think the big message of this film for starters is just like teachers that care about their job wanting to do the best thing possible, but how sometimes making the right decision is incredibly difficult and how sometimes making the right decision can really put you in an awful situation. And our lead character, as we watch throughout the movie, she never really does anything that you're like, okay, this was the wrong choice. It, it feels like rational. Even the recording of her stuff, you're, you're like, okay, someone's stealing. I don't want my stuff to get stolen. But then it turns to a larger question of, did you violate people's privacy? You're doing this, you're in a public space. And then like even things with the kids, um, the kids start turning against her because they're upset about how one of the kids is being treated. And it's like, I'm just reporting this situation. I have nothing to do with that. And then thinking about like children versus teachers in school and how like if the kids don't wanna do something and they all rally together, there's more of them than there are of you. And, and there's a lot of like horrifying implications Applications to what it means to be a teacher in this movie that I think really pay off well. But I think the at the end of the day, what prevails is if you love kids and you want to teach and you want to uh, to help build a better future for the world by educating these young minds, it's not going to be an easy task. It's going to be difficult and you're going to have to make difficult decisions. And I think that's what resonated with me more than anything else in the movie. As I said at the beginning, I don't think it's perfect. There are some scenes that feel a little bit repetitive and there are a couple of moments that I think could have been pushed around to make the movie a bit more effective but I don't think that that takes away from just how suspenseful and intense this movie is and I really liked it a lot I'm already looking forward to giving this a revisit sometime in the future to see if I pull any more away from it and I definitely think it is a movie that is 100% worth you checking out so have you seen the teacher's lounge did you love it did you hate it leave me a comment down below let me know what you thought I thought this movie was really well made I thought the lead performance was incredible. I thought it was suspenseful and I did not expect that from this type of a movie. As always, if you like the video and subscribe to the channel, helps me out a lot, lets me know the type of content you're looking for. I'm always putting out new material and look forward to getting more out for you in the near future. And as always, everyone, thank you so much for watching and have a great rest of your day.